hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so i don't know if you watched the previous video like where i was brushing out those all of this hair but welcome to those who are continuing thank you so much this is actually quite fun like look how big this hair is for those who are new welcome i'm so proud that you have joined i am crystal and i'm i'm about to do my makeup because i said um in the previous video i need to get some zendaya diana ross vibes on like just can you just this is all my hair guys like all my hair um so i just want to hop right into this because i did the hair the whole brush out thing and i feel that this needs makeup so let's get straight into this oh my god <laughs> like it has so much hair okay let's get this amongst all my makeup stuff so if you give me two seconds i'm sure i will be able to find a primer I have moisturized my face already guys so I'm literally just going in on sections of the prime and I also googled the look of the day when she had like really big hair like if you don't know I'm a purple photo somewhere right about here and I am going to recreate that you know that she had very um simple eye makeup but nice bold brows and a bright orange look and because it's winter on my side you know we have to make sure we stay flawless and glowing like she was having her highlight on point so obviously brows first I am going in with the brow goof proof at a number five if I can mind it uh, number five and obviously I'm not going to be showing you the entire process but if you haven't watched my brow tutorial or help me helping my sister out please go check those videos out while I get my brows on point and I'm going to be doing a very uh, classic arched shape so that way my eyes look bigger so I can apply a really bold uh, neutral eye because of the photo but we are going to go through this so this is what my brows look like after I've done that whole process of contouring and angling. I'm going in with my Pro Concealer. This is what it looks like. There we go. My Pro Concealer is like almost finished. Okay, so, and I'm doing that to angle and shape my brows as well as prep my eyelid. Okay, so this is what my brows look like. As you can see, I've like lengthened it as well as I've changed the angle. So, <clears throat> I've just done this section. It's time to do some eyeshadow. <laughs> so, big vibing with this. So, looking at Zendaya's photo, I can see she has a very natural mood. I, I'm gonna amp it up just a little bit so that way I get a little more definition because I do not have Zendaya's full skin. I do not have that structure of her photos. I can create it though. As a makeup artist, I can create it though. So let's not hold back. Okay. I'm going in with. Let me show you. So this is my design palette. I think it's called Dawn to Dust. I'm going in with that light brown shade over there, and I'm going from the inner of my eye to halfway of my eye. It's literally going to be a quick and easy and simple. I keep forgetting where I put my. This is my mirror, guys. I don't. A handheld mirror is somewhere in this house, but I use this. And I'm just gonna start dabbing that. And then, because it's very natural, we don't have to pack a lot. Okay, so you can see it more on the side because I have a lot more shadow on the side than on the side, but they're both evenly put, and I put it up until this point. So, about your pupil. Or just a little over your pupil now because in there has such a natural color on the end of the outer I'm gonna stick with my palette my dust till dawn designer palette and I'm gonna go for the dark medium brown this one here 
that one. Yeah, I'm gonna go for that and I'm doing it very lightly. Guys, when I say lightly, I mean very lightly. You have to have a very light hand and I'm gonna be using my angled eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna be just tapping and dabbing on the side so that way it's not picking up much. And then I'm going in to the side and blurring that softly in. Mm. So I haven't blended yet and what I'm going to do to blend my blending brush there, you can see that. That's my blending brush and what I'm doing is I'm going in with this brown This like medium, it's, oh it has very orange undertone so I know I can point it out I'm going with that brown and I'm just dabbing a little, not a lot, just a little just to do the blend and keep it very natural, very close to my skin tone and I'm blending that with the eye. But I'm using very neutral champagne, brown, nude colors to just keep it going, just to keep my eyes on point. So, liquid liner, I'm going to be doing a small. So that's how small. I don't know if it's, but that's how small I'm gonna be doing. And I pulled it up because I want the snatched look. I'm not pulling it directly how I usually do to give me the longer eye. I'm pulling it up to give me a snatch because remember the day so it's a snatched. Like okay, like it's beautiful. So that's what I'm doing. And that's literally the wing so as you can see it's very small today very calm but we are gonna add lashes later on don't you break don't don't worry about that we'll be adding lashes we will I'm going to be doing foundation on shape this up a bit and then I'm gonna get my finishing spray I got a new like a small finishing spray it's really different but I'm gonna be putting this on and then I'm going to be doing my contour afterwards. So, and because I want to keep that low, like Zendaya has in a photo, um, I'm going to be applying it with the brush. Brush foundation, you yeah, guys. You're so used to seeing me with, you know, not using brush, or I usually use a sponge. Remember, my face is still damp. So, Okay, so foundation is done. I'm gonna do concealer in this section, this section, this, and then we're gonna see how we're gonna get that glow, this and that glow. Mm. I'm gonna be using the contour palette or concealer palette, like that. And I'm gonna be using like the light shade. So either this, I'm mixing between this shade and this shade. As you can see, that is almost finished. This is what my concealer section looks like. So as you can see, I hit there, hit there, hit there, hit there, and hit there. That's what it looks like, okay? Then we blend. We blend. Okay. So that is that. Now it's time. Oh, do you see that glow? Do you see that? I don't even have highlighter on, guys. And just look at that. Look how it's picking up. Okay, time to set and then I'm going to put the face lashes on. Oh, actually, no. Yeah, let's put the face lashes on. Let's put them on. Let's put them on. 
Okay, so as you can see, bam, I have lashes. So after that, I am going to just dust off my whole enchilada of baking. They say you shouldn't bake in winter because like it makes your skin dry. But I'm an oily person, so. my little flat it's supposed to be a contour brush but <clears throat> I'm gonna be using it to highlight and I'm going in with both the bronze highlight and my shimmer highlight so I'm just tapping both and I'm going to start from my cheekbone and because it has such a wide as you can see it's a bit wider I don't have to do this I just have to go back and forth on my cheekbone I'm gonna put on the apple and then drag it back to give me a lift. So from the apples, back, apples, back. Now here's the shocking part. Zendaya has an orange lipstick. Now guys, I need to go find or make an orange because I don't own an orange lipstick. I used to have one. You know, but then it turns matte instead of gloss. So, what I'm going to be doing is mixing my lip gloss and an eyeshadow. Stay tuned to see how this turns out. <laughs> So guys, this is the look. Uh, I mix orange eyeshadow and lip gloss. So rate what you think. Um, let me just kick. Let me kick this hair down. Let me just get ready for you guys. Give me two seconds. Okay guys, this is the final look. Let me know what you think. Did I do Zendaya proud? Hmm? With the big hair, orange lip. Let me know. Check that glow. Ah! So proud of this. But damn. Zendaya, if you need a, a double, stunt double, or just like a double, I don't mind. Might not have your body, but hey, I could pull off your angles, hopefully. Uh, so guys let me know down in the comments below if you liked this look if you think I did good rate me from a scale of 1 to 10 if you feel I could wear this just this don't look at this just this on the red carpet let me know if you liked this video like down below comment subscribe share with your friends share with family members just keep sharing thank you so much for the growth that you have shown that you are capable of for me and so 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 proud to be showing you this look have a great time and see you next time